Hey everyone, my name is Riley and this video is a review on Veed.io. This video is a brutally honest review covering everything I like about Veed as well as some of the things that I really don't like about this platform. Before we jump into this, if you do want to grab a free account with Veed, you can do so using the top link in the description. So starting out with the most basic and most important feature of Veed is the basic video editing tools. Now, this is pretty good and pretty easy to use. For example, if I want to make a clip or if I want to cut a certain element out of my video, I can go to split right here, move this along, split, and then simply go and delete this content and drag these together. So super simple and easy to use interface right here in terms of the basic video editing. We can also adjust the volume right here very easily adjust the speed, add some animations, and my overall kind of review and take on the basic video editing features is that they are absolutely fantastic. However, they are a little bit basic. So this is a lot easier to use than something like Adobe Premiere Pro, but it doesn't have as many features. So if you are maybe a newer video editor or you are looking for something on the cheaper end, this is a much better idea than Premiere Pro, but it just comes with a few limitations. Things like color grading, you can't get certain effects. But as I say, if you are new, that's not really an issue. The next thing that I want to talk about is the magic tools and some of these AI features. For example, we can go to translate voice in here and we can actually translate this video into another language. Now, this feature, in my opinion, is really not the best compared to some AI platforms that are specifically built for this feature. For example, this is a video that I translated into Spanish using Veed. El software que vamos a utilizar. And this is a video that I translated to Spanish using Eleven Labs that is specifically built for this feature. Hola a todos, mi nombre es Wiley y en este video voy a mostrarte... You can see there's a massive, massive difference in quality right there. So although this isn't the best feature, the one good thing that I would say about this is this is a more all-in-one platform where you can do a whole array of different things. Veed is more of a jack of all trades rather than a specialist in one. So if you are using Veed specifically for these voice translation features, I would not recommend it and Eleven Labs is much better. And if you want to see a review of Eleven Labs, I will leave that in the description of the video. Veed also does make it super simple to create like YouTube shorts or TikTok shorts. It is going to clip the video down and actually automatically adjust the size. So just like that, you can see I now have a YouTube short that I can create. We can add subtitles to this using Veed, so we can go subtitles right here. However, once again, the subtitles are not the best. You can't get these moving subtitles like you can with a software like the script. And they are just going to be static like the ones that you see on screen right now. One feature that I really love with Veed that you don't get with a lot of other video editing software is this tool right here to remove silences. This is something that you don't even have to render. I can literally click remove silences and just like that, all of the silences and pauses and gaps in the video is going to be removed. We also have these filters that you can't really get with other tools. And what I would say is you can use this color grading right here. However, you can't really customize the color grading in the way that you can with something like Premiere Pro. So you effectively have to choose from one of these options right here to do your color grading. Once again, this is a lot better for somebody that doesn't have that much experience. But if you are a super high-end professional video editor, this isn't going to be color grading that you can rely on to get fantastic and professional color grading. So overall, Veed is a pretty good platform for if you are a beginner to maybe intermediate video editor. It is definitely a more jack of all trades rather than a speciality in one area. And we can really see this in the lack of quality in some of the AI features. However, if you are looking for a cheap but effective video editor, Veed is absolutely fantastic. Now, if you found this video valuable, don't forget to smash that like button and tap that subscribe button. And until next time, take it easy.